Okay, so this is the first three cups or organizer that you would see if you open my drawer. So, itong mga to, more on like lipstick, multi-use products, highlighters, eyeshadow toppers, tapos dito yung more eyeshadow, face palettes, saka blushes, and powders. And so, i-organize ko to ngayon with you guys para matanggal ko dito yung mga hindi ko talaga nagagamit realistically and yung mga gusto ko bigyan ng chance para magka-space, para magkaroon ako ng space for other products that I've been eyeing online. And yeah, so let's start with this section first. So this is the first cup and this is like lip products. So ayun, let's start with this one. So as you can see, I have here yung new shades ng colorette except for rosa rosa so i have here isla mara and manila kasi naisip ko na alam mo yon pang everyday sila pwede ko sila gamitin for like easy looks but it turns out na super maputla sa akin si isla at sa kasi mara i tried using these two today pero kahit minex ko sila parang ang putla pa rin for a simple makeup look and so, tatanggalin ko sila dito. Ititira ko si Manila. Kasi si Manila, this is more of like an everyday look. I feel like mas magagamit ko siya in terms of like, you know, for my everyday look. And so, magsistay si Manila dito. Next one is itong Happy Skin Kiss and Bloom Glossy Tint. I always use these uh, glossy tints. I have the shade Bud and Sunny. Actually, mas ginagamit ko si Sunny kesa kay Bud. Is, magsistay dito si Sunny ni si Bud. Tatanggalin ko muna dito to make space for other lip products. Okay, next ones are these Hydra Glosses from Izzy & Co. I really do love these. I use them all the time. I feel like I've been using them every time I do my makeup. And so, they are definitely staying. I actually want to put Love Boat here as well kasi hold on i just want to use love boat more and yeah so i'll put this in here okay next one is this um, blk creamy all over paint in the shade summertime i'm not into cream blushes at the moment i have been using powder blushes so i thought that i would get a lot of use out of this but i just prefer powder blush at the moment and yeah so i think i'm going to put this away muna for now and see how i feel about it okay next one is itong kiss and bloom happy skin velvet lip and cheek stain this is in the shade um, drama queen this one i really do love the shade it's not the best formula out there for the lips it's actually pretty drying but i love this i love the shade and i whenever i use this i would just put lip gloss on top and so yeah I'll, this is definitely staying here my last one is itong hyper gleam i love this so much i just put this on throughout the day i love the smell i love the feel of this on the lips and yeah so this is definitely staying here so my counting space dito next tayo dito muna tayo so um itong maybelline super stay matte ink in the shade hustler i really do like the shade of this for a red lipstick this is the shade i was wearing last video and I really love this red shade and I feel like I want to use this more and so lilipat ko siya dito since may space na. Okay, itong velvet click stick ng Strokes Beauty. To be honest, I thought that I would use these a lot. Hindi ko talaga sila nagagamit masyado. Pero I really do love the shade Contessa. Itong parang, ano siya eh, parang siyang brownie nude. And I really do love this shade. And I want to give it more chance. And so, ilalagay ko siya dito. These two, this is the shade Copperhead and Teresa. Itatabi ko muna sila because I really don't use them a lot but I really like the formula it's just that mas para mas nagustuhan ko yung mga mousse formula recently so ayun 
Okay, so itong Velvet, I mean, itong Get Ready With Me Cosmetics. In the shade, I have here si Okinawa at saka si 100% Sugar. Si Okinawa, itatabi ko muna si Okinawa kasi I find myself using 100% Sugar at saka si Cheesecake more. Si Cheesecake nasa dulo siya ng drawer. So, ilalagay ko siya dito sa harap para mas magamit ko siya. Si Cheesecake, I really do love this for like my... For for my blush, kakasabi ko lang na I don't like cream blushes. Pero sobrang ganda ng formula nitong Get Ready With Me Cosmetics. Hindi siya ganun ka... I don't know, I just really like the formula of this. And I really don't mind using this for my cream blush. Especially itong cheesecake. Sobrang nakaka-fresh. Dito ko siya ilalagay. Itong 100% sugar, I like this shade for my lips. And so, magsistay siya dito. And ito si Okinawa, itatabi ko muna siya. Okay, itong BLK Excellent. Si Little Messy, maganda sana yung shade neto. Kaya lang sira siya. As in, ayan o, no, putol. So, itatabi ko muna siya. Tapos, ito si Katleya. Ito yung pinaka-feeling ko wearable everyday shade from the collection. And so, I'll give it more chance. Although, I don't... I don't find myself using this a lot. I want to give it more chance. And so, magsistay siya dito muna. In the hopes of me using this more. Okay, next ones are these Mersey Velvet Tints. I really love the formula of the Mersey Tints. Velvet Tints. And I love the shade V14. Like, V14 is definitely my favorite shade from this collection. And so, this is for sure staying here. Tapos, ito, yung Mersey Velvet Tint, yung Heritage Collection nila. Iiwan ko dito yung V19 because V19 is like my perfect red. And so, yeah, iwan ko si V19 dito. Si V21, um, itatabi ko muna siya kasi I find myself reaching for deeper red shades. And this one is like more on like brown maroon shade. So, yeah. Hindi ko masyadong feel to for now. So, yeah. Tabi ko muna siya. And itong um, Hyper Gleam Hydrating Lip Gloss in the shade Candy Apple. I still haven't used this, but I really want to use this up just because um, talagang yung lagi ko talaga nagagamit yung Hydro Glosses, but I really want to use this. I tried it on my lips, pero hindi ko pa siya nagagamit masyado to really like formulate my opinion. Okay, may naligaw dito na brow refiner and ash. I use this a lot, pero this is not the place for it. Dito siya sa likod, but yeah. So ayan, as you can see, mas marami na tayong space for new products. So I can shop for new <laughs> lip products or like multi-use products. So... I think I did a good job on these two. Okay, dito tayo sa highlighter, eyeshadow toppers, and blush and powders. Okay, so this is the Touch and Soul Sparkling Foil Pigment. I use this a lot. Especially kapag, ano, like gusto ko ng mas oomph <laughs> yung eyeshadow ko. Ayan, kinagat to ni Begal eh, kaya may ganyan. Basag ito. Kinagat kasi. So, but I still use it. I love this. This is actually shattered. But I still use it. So, this is definitely staying here. Itong BLK Shimmer Jelly Multi Pot. I think magsistay dito si Golden Hour than Pearl. Si Pearl, sakto lang. I like the Golden Hour. For like eyeshadow or like um, highlighter. Actually, to be honest, I'm really not into highlighter these days. I just like a healthier base, but not like shiny. But I, I'm still, I still like it sometimes. And so I feel like I can use this sometimes if I want that look. And so yeah. And another highlighter is this Nude Sticks All Over Face Color in the shade Hey Honey. This is a highlighter. And this is like... One of my favorite highlighters. Kasi sobrang, alam mo yung basa lang siya tignan. 
and it complements my skin tone a lot. And so, kahit na hindi ako masyado nag-highlight, I, I like having it here. This one from Happy Skin, yung soft, pretty easy soft touch eyeshadow in the shade A+. I like this for like topper, quick looks. So, this is definitely staying here. Itong Bodyography Glitter in the shade Stellar. This is like a glitter pigment. I got this on Amazon sa States. So, I love this a lot. Like, sobrang glittery niya, sparkly. Okay, dito naman tayo sa eyeshadow, I mean, sa blushes, powders, konting eyeshadow face palette. So, let's start with, this is the Velvet Flush in the shade Lucas. Ayan, gamit na gamit siya and nasira na siya. Actually, sobrang sayang kasi hindi sturdy yung packaging. Ang dami nagre-reklamo but that is definitely not stopping me from using this. And this is definitely a keeper for me. Kaya lang wala na siyang lalagyanan. Try natin dito kung kasha. Okay, hindi siya kasha. So, dito na lang siya. Next one is itong Vice X and Clutes palette. I really like this for like a quick look kapag gusto ko ng bronzer at saka blush on. Although yung highlighter on the chunkier side siya, but I don't mind sometimes. It's a look. <laughs> and yeah, so this is like for quick looks and yeah, super convenient to have this here. So this is definitely a keeper here for now. Okay, next one is itong BLK Free Spirit Multi Palette. I really like this, itong uh, Free Spirit. I don't like the uh, Mystic Dreamer one. Masyado siyang orange for me. And yeah, medyo weird lang yung shade. So, I'll keep this. I like this for like my... I like this shade for my lips. Actually, both shades. So, yeah, I'll try to use this more, I guess, and give it more chance for me to use it for, like, my everyday look or something like that. But this one, itatabi ko muna siya since I really don't find myself wanting to use this. Okay, next one is itong Velvet Flush in the shade Bow. I really do love this as a lip color. And yeah, I'm definitely keeping this here because I use this kapag sobrang I don't know what lipstick to wear. I just put this on and then put lip balm on top kasi drying to for the lips. So this is definitely staying here. Okay, this Caroline Loose Powder, I like this. This is good for oil control. And I use this kapag gusto ko ng matte finish. Itong Velvet Flush in the shade Luna. So, this was sent to me by um, Detail Cosmetics. Nung pinadala nila ako ng maraming products nila. I do love the shade, pero I'm really not reaching for this a lot. And so, feeling ko, itatabi ko muna siya para magamit ko naman yung ibang, yung ibang shades. And para uh, mabigyan ko ng chance itong si BLK. So, ayun. Goodbye. Next one is itong si Izzy & Co. Cream Blush in the shade Brunette. This one I love also. Actually, very similar sila ni Lucas. Like, very similar sila ng shade. More on like, ano ba to? More on like brownie nude. Actually, I don't need both of these. So, um, I feel like iiwan ko dito si Izzy & Co. Tatabi ko muna si Lucas kasi sira din naman siya and nainis ako minsan. But Izzy & Co is staying here. Tatabi ko muna to si Lucas. Maybe I'll pass it on kasi maganda siya. I feel like, I don't know. We'll see. So, tatabi ko muna siya para magka-space si Izzy & Co. I mean, para magamit ko si Izzy & Co. Okay, next one is ito. Ito ang EB Advance in the shade Dahlia. Sobrang ganda nito. As in, ang ganda ng formula. Sobrang soft. Hindi siya patchy on my cheeks. And I find myself using this a lot. Actually, I'm wearing this right now. And ang ganda lang niya. And yeah, so this is definitely staying. Nalagay ko siya dito kasi kasha na siya dito. Tapos, next one is itong Squadlet Eyeshadow Palette in the shade Shy. 
Actually, I like this. Hindi ko lang siya nakikita dito. So, so I feel like kailangan ko siyang ilagay where I can see. I'll just put it here. May space pa naman dito. And I have more space for other products. Para lang makita ko siya. Kasi ito, itong shade na to, maganda siya pang set ng eyelids. Like for like a base. And maganda yung tone na to. Hindi siya masyadong warm. And I like it. So, I want to use this more, and so I'll put it here. Itong All Covered by Anakai Powder Sunscreen, I want to use it more. I feel like it's clogging my pore, pores, but I still need to use it to really be uh, certain na super na clog niya yung pores ko. Pero, I like this. Yun lang. I need to know kung kinaklog mo yung pores ko. Okay, next one is itong Izzy & Co. Weightless Loose Powder in the shade Translucent. I like this, especially for filming. Parang may blurring effect siya when I'm on camera. Especially for someone na super light lang mag-makeup kahit filming. So, ayan. So far, meron space dito sa first two for maybe like dito two lip products pa or like motifs or whatever. Dito, I feel like kasha dito like three, three lip products. So, ayan. May space na! I think I did a good job. Dito, um, ayusin ko nga. Tingnan ko kung mas may space. So, kasi nakikita eh. Wala, wala. So, puno na to. <laughs> so, ayun. So, lipat na tayo sa back part na tong drawer. Okay. So, this is the back part of the drawer. So, these are like my brow products, primer, skin tints, concealer, um, highlighter. Medyo random, but for me, it kind of makes sense how I use them. And so, yeah, I organize ko kasi may mga products ako nalagay dito na hindi naman dapat dito. And yung mga products na hindi ko naman nagagamit, um, I'll put it aside first to make space for like new products to try, new products to love. So, I guess we'll start here. This is like skin tints, primers, I don't know, we'll... We'll see what this is all about. <laughs> okay. Okay, first one. Okay, so this one is the Izzy & Co. Active Skin Tint in the shade Beach. Actually, I really do love this. Pero, I haven't been using skin tints as much. Pero, kung, kung maglalagay man ako ng skin tint, this is definitely my first choice. And reason why I haven't been using this is because sobrang light sa akin ni Beach. I have to use other shades like itong BLK1 para makuha ko yung shade ko. Pero I'm just waiting for them to release um, yung hazel kasi feeling ko yun talaga yung shade ko. Definitely keeping this here. I don't know why. I just like having this here. Or maybe not. Sige, tanggalin ko muna siya so that I have a reminder to get the shade hazel. Okay, tanggalin ko muna si Izzy and Co. here. Next, next one is itong Turn On Cream by Dewy Cell. Medyo mattifying siya on my skin and parang nababrighten niya yung skin ko. Um, I'm really not into like priming my face or anything like that right now. I just want, when I do my makeup, gusto ko like wala nang primer, like concealer agad, ganun. <laughs> so, I don't see myself using this so itatabi ko muna siya. Ito naman yung eye plus cream ng Dewy Cell. Actually, maganda to. Like, maganda siya if you need extra hydration for your under eyes. Especially kapag medyo dry skin siya. Maganda to as like a moisturizer. Pero, I don't... Hindi ko siya ginagamit. And, yeah. So, tanggalin ko siya dito. This one, itong BB cream ng Detail Cosmetics. Actually, um... I don't know. I'm really not into skin tints right now or BB cream. I still prefer like just doing concealer. And yung formula nito okay lang. Medyo nabibigatan ako. I tried giving it um, another chance. Pero I think I've decided na I don't like this one. So, ayun. Okay. Meron ditong color bomb. 
in the shade Cosmo. Actually, itatabi ko to. Kaya siya nasa likod. Kasi nilalagay ko rin sa likod yung mga hindi ko masyadong ginagamit. So, obviously, this one, itatabi ko rin siya for now. Okay, so next one is... Ah, asan yung isa nito? I really like this as like an eyeshadow base. And so, this will stay here. Hindi ko mahanap yung blue. Like, meron ako na tong blue, yung shade na Peacock. But wala dito. But yeah, this is definitely staying here. Itong eyeliner from Dita Cosmetics. Itong liquid eyeliner. Maganda naman to. Okay naman to. Pero I really don't use liquid eyeliner. Pero if I need to use it, if I need a black eyeliner, I feel like this will come in handy. And so, it's staying here. Itong lip mousse ng Izzy and Co. In the shade Sweet Talk. Um, unfortunately, hindi ko talaga gusto yung shade. Pero the formula is okay then. I'm still trying to figure out the best way to apply this. But itatabi ko siya for now. I'm actually eyeing on other shades. And so, yes. Yeah. Okay, so itong Sunny's Face Life Brow. In the shade... What's this? In the shade... I don't know. Masyado siyang minimal na hindi na kahit yung shade wala. I don't like this. Okay naman siya. It's decent. Pero parang masyado niyang na-alter yung shade ng brows ko. Like, nagiging gray siya. Especially in picture. Parang weird na tignan. So, tatanggalin ko siya dito. Okay, next one. Ito yung Sunny's Face. Um, what do you call this? Ewan ko yung eyebrow something nila. I like... I like keeping this here kung gusto ko man mag, ano, like yung freckle look. So, I'll keep this here. Itong Get Ready With Me Cosmetics in the shade Fruity. Kaya ito nasa likod kasi this is the shade that I really don't want to use for my skin tone. And so, tatabi ko muna siya. Ayan, dami na nating space. This EB Advanced Studio Finish Brow Pen. I don't see myself using this and so goodbye okay next one is itong mac eye Co liner in the shade fascinating i like using white eyeliner and so this is a keeper here itong blk skin tint in the shade almond this is not my shade i wanted butterscotch pero sobrang their customer service is like one of the worst so, yeah. So, tatabi ko muna to since I really don't use skin tints in general. So, ayun. Okay, itong Vice X and Clutes Eyeliners. I have two here. I have the shade black and soft lang brown. I like these two. And so, they are definitely staying here. Tapos, itong um, Sunny's Lip Treat in the shade Chai. I actually really like this. I've used quite a lot. And... I'm not sure. This is a maybe kung magsistay siya dito. But for now, tanggalin ko muna siya. Okay, so ang dami ng space for this one. Okay, dito naman tayo sa gitna. This one is like my concealer, eyebrow products, mascara. So, okay, let's start. This one from Detail Cosmetics. I really don't like this concealer. Um, the shade, okay naman. Pero, I don't know. I just don't like it. I'm very picky with my concealer and this one, ayaw ko siya. Okay, next one is itong, um, itong Strokes Beauty Paint Duo. I always use these. Like, these are like my eyeshadows. I think that's the reason why I'm not purchasing eyeshadow palettes because sobrang satisfied na ako with just these. Medyo tricky lang to use, especially yung shimmery, but once you get the hang of it, it can look beautiful and yeah, so they are definitely a keeper. Lalagay ko sila dito kasi mas may space na. This one, the Kimchi Chic, most, the most concealer. I love this one. Um, I'm always using it, especially if wala kong tulog. This one is definitely nice. So that's a keeper. Itong BLK Cosmetics um, Mascara. Ang ganda nito. Ang hirap niya tanggalin na kay Ines, but that is definitely not stopping me from using it. Itong Dua Lash from Detail Cosmetics, I like this. Especially for like, kung ayoko naman masyadong dramatic yung lashes ko, pero gusto ko ng definition, I use this one. Madali siya tanggalin din. 
This Maybelline uh, Instant Age Rewind, I like. This is in the shade medium. Pag mas gusto ko ng heavier coverage, I use this one. Of course, my Caroline Acne Spot Concealer is staying here. Um, oh, and dito pala yung Hyper Gleam in the shade Jupiter. Jupiter. I definitely want to use this, so it's staying there. Tapos itong mga brow gels. Of course, I love my brow gels. I have here the Izzy & Co. Brow Refiner. I have this Strokes Beauty Brow Colorist. They are all staying. Tapos ito yung EB Advance Brow Mascara in the shade Chai. I like that also. Ito, ay, ito, yung Studio Finish Brow Pen. I don't, I don't, I don't see myself using this. And so, yeah. Um, eto brow painter from Strokes Beauty. I like I like this a lot. So it's staying here. So ayan, my space na ulit ito. And actually, yung mga nandito, pwede kong ilipat dito kasi yung iba dito pang brow gel din eh. Like this one. This is the Strokes Beauty Brow Fixer. Dito siya. I actually, ito Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. Lilipat ko dito. Let's, let's move on here. So, ito yung mga primer, um, highlighters. I don't know. Medyo random siya. So, ito Sunny's Face. The Perfector. I like the blur side of this. But I haven't used this in a while. But I still want to give this a... No, I really am not using any kind of primer. And so, wait lang. And so, wala. Um, tatabi ko muna to. Um, kung may primer man ako na gusto gamitin, this is like my go-to. Itong Becca primers. Itong first light priming filter or itong backlight priming filter. They are staying here kasi like they are like my go-to primer. This, ano, Strokes Beauty Brow Sculptor Duo. And itong um, Detail Cosmetics Super Fine Liner. I don't know. I, <laughs> feeling ko kasi minsan, I want to dabble into like um, eyebrow pencils. Kaya sila nandito. But I don't use them. But I feel like I want to use them. So, dito muna sila while I'm undecided. Itong L'Oreal True Match in the shade Golden Beige. This is my shade kapag sobrang may like tan ako pero uh, right now masyado siyang deep for me. So tatabi ko muna siya. I have here highlighters. So <coughs> I have here Tiger's Eye from Colorette. I have here Moon Beauty in the shade Moonlight and gamit na gamit siya. And this Sunny's Face Barbarella. Actually, I like all of these. And kung may highlighter man ako nagagamitin sila yon, so I'll definitely keep them here. Tong EB lip liner in the shade Mirrored Mocha. Ito lang yung lip liner na ginagamit ko. Or yung di ko alam ko na sa yung next lip liner ko. But I use this a lot kung gusto ko man mag lip liner. And then last but not the least, itong Vaseline Reveal Lip Scrub. I use this kapag, alam mo yun, magli-lip swatch ako just to like scrub. But I don't use this often. I just like toothbrush my lips and parang it's the same thing. But I like having it here. And so, yan. So, mas organized na sila. And mas maraming space. Marami ng space for new products. And ayan. So tapos na tayo dito. We'll move on to the next one. So wait lang. Okay, so next one. Ito yung ano, nasa table ko obviously. Gusto ko ilagay dito yung mga products na ginagamit ko everyday. Especially when gusto ko lang yung super quick makeup. My go-to makeup. Hindi ito yung mga to. Super random lang ito. Actually, tatanggalin ko sila. Tanggalin ko muna silang lahat. Tapos, magsa-start tayo from scratch. Okay, so, of course, alcohol. Dito yan, for sure. And then, itong Hydra Gloss in the, sh in the shade Surf, for sure. Kapag gusto ko lang ng, ano, alam mo yun, hydrating my lips, lalo na kapag nage-edit ako. 
Gusto ko rin, ano, kunin from the drawer itong Hyper Gleam Lip Gloss. Kasi I always reach for this kapag gusto ko lang din ng hydrating something for my lips. And then, ito, ito rin, yung Strokes Beauty Silk Kiss in the shade Passionate Peach. Like, gusto ko rin ilagay dito kasi wala lang. Gusto ko na nourish yung lips ko while I'm doing like editing and stuff like that. Ito pala, yung Clush Flame in the shade Basque. Um, ilalagay ko dito para matatandaan ko na I need to review that. So, ayun. Of course, yung eyelash curler from Deviant. I like this. I'll also put that here. And then, of course, my concealer. Caroline Acne Spot Concealer. Diyan siya. Ito, sobrang quick look lang. Ilalagay ko rin dito yung Izzy Co. Brow Refiner. Ay! Asan yung ash? I can't find yung brow re refiner in ash. Pero, once I find it, ilalagay ko siya dito. Actually, pwede na to. Yung Caroline Oil, Co Oil Control Loose Mattifying Powder for like quick touch up. And, kasha ba siya? Hindi siya kasha. So, never mind. Walang, walang powder. Quick blush. Quick blush on. Feeling ko ito. Kasi sobrang nagandahan talaga ako dyan for now. Si Sunny's Face Lip Treat in the shade Chai. Ilalagay ko rin siya dito. Saka, I guess, yung Real Technique sponge ko. Ilalagay ko lang din siya dito. Para may pop of color. <laughs> so, ayan. So, this is like my super quick everyday makeup look kapag gusto ko lang ng something. Yung mga go-to products ko talaga. Yeah, I guess makakagawa na ako ng very quick and simple look with just these except for this one eto I'm putting this here because I really want to test it out wala akong brow I guess pwede na tong brow refiner in clear pero pag nahanap ko yung ash papalitan ko siya ng ash so ayan I'll put this here so ayan yan yung aking um I don't know, everyday table <laughs> makeup. So, yeah, so and dami ko ng space for new makeup. I think that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye!